Hey! Welcome to my channel, guys. Mama P in the kitchen again today. All right, so what you making? I'm gonna make pepper shrimp, Jamaican street food. All right, nice, nice. All right, so tell me, what's the ingredients, Mom? Okay, here I have two pounds of shrimp. It's washed with lemon and vinegar. Mm-hmm. And here I have four that I save. I'm going to take out the digestive tract. I already take them out of these already, but then I'm going to take them out for, you know, people to see. Then here I have a scotch bonnet pepper and a jalapeno pepper. I have two, but I don't know if I'm going to use all of these seeds because I don't like too much eat. If the person likes eat, they can go ahead and use as much pepper as they want. I have onion. I have thyme, I have a couple of pimento berries, I have some butter, garlic, and I have some sazon here to give it some color. I have the shrimp bouillon, black pepper, a little seasoned salt, a little obe, and some ground paprika. Oh, nice, 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 nice. All right, so here I am going to clean this shrimp. This is how I take out this thing here the yeah, digestive the, yeah that black line yeah the digestive truck i'm gonna take it out this is all right i just pinch it and then i just pull it right out So just let me rinse these off already. I rinsed them already, but I'm gonna. Yeah, but because she's cleaning it and she's stripping, she just likes to wash, wash them, it. rinse it again. That's yes. all. And then I'm gonna take off these whiskers. Dry them. Then she has to dry the fish. I mean, the dry the shrimp. I guess just to make sure that all the seasonings can get on it. It doesn't yeah. fall off. Because she's just patting them dry the best that she can. Okay, so I'm going to sprinkle on my whole bay and them. And you see, she's eyeing it. She's not um, measuring. Yeah, eyeballing. Eyeballing. Eye <laughs> yeah. This is the paprika, some seasoning salt, a pinch of black pepper, and I'm gonna leave the sazon to put on there for last. I remember when I was a kid, like when I would go to some of the Jamaican restaurants, they would always have that pepper shrimp. Yeah, and when so you go to Jamaica too, mm -hmm. they have it on the street in the plastic bag. Yeah, it tastes so good. So mm -hmm. I'm glad, I'm glad she's making it now. So I'm gonna cut up the pepper, and I'm not gonna use all the seed because I can't take too much of the heat. So I'm gonna take some of the seeds out. But if you like, if you love a uh, spice, you know, yeah, then keep the seeds in there. I keep some, but not all. Not all. Because like, the seeds make it very hot. So she cut it in half, and she only pit one half of the of the, the seed. of the pepper. And this is a scotch bonnet. Mm -hmm. And this is the jalapeno pepper too. It's hot too, but not as hot as the scotch bonnet. smell that pepper oh all right all right so here i'm gonna move everything over here to the stove mm -hmm. yeah i'm gonna put about two tablespoon of olive oil not too much all right it's then really hot ooh, mm -hmm. let me turn this off it's like it get too hot all right so let me go in with my onions now I'm just gonna let them okay. turn them around, let them look translucent. I'm gonna go in with my garlic now. 
and I don't want the garlic to burn because then garlic burns horribly. It smells good already. Mm -hmm. Then I'm gonna go in with my thyme and my pimento berries. Let's get that aroma in there. Mm-hmm. Then I take her. Take her the shrimp. And shrimp doesn't take long to cook. Within 10-15 minutes it will be cooked. Well, it the depends top. on the type of shrimp. Some the shrimp takes about three minutes, but these are bigger. But, yeah, and these have the shells on. Yes. So when they have the shells, ooh, that's pepper. All right, I'm going to go with my butter. All right, so... Instead of use food coloring, I use a little sazan to give it that rich color. Mm -hmm. And she only like put what a half a packet in it? Yeah, I'm just gonna see. Let me start this in first. I'm gonna rinse this out. This is about a tablespoon or two of water. Alright, so. I'm gonna go in with some of my shrimp bouillon, just a piece, not too much. Let me crack it. Shrimp bouillon. Put a little piece more. And a pinch of salt. And looking like that pepper shrimp, I know. Yep. All right. So this is my shrimp and crab boil. I'm going to toss a little bit in there too. My shrimp and crab boil. All right. So I'm going to cover this. Oh, let me put a little bit more sazon. Let me cut, bring up the color a little brighter. All right, I'm gonna cover this and let it steam for about 10-15 minutes because you don't want your shrimp to cook too long. Right, let me leave it there. All right, let's see here. Okay. Oh, this looks so good. Guys, you can, if you're close to this and you see this, oh my goodness. And this is like what? About eight minutes. Yeah, eight minutes. Yeah, sure. Yeah, don't take cooked. long. All right, so I'm turning my stove off. All right. And then I'm going to dig right in because mm. I really love pepper shrimp. Nice. All right. Okay, there you have it, guys. Pepper shrimp. Please like, share, and subscribe to my channel. And as of now, I'm just going to dig right in because this looks so delicious. All right. Yeah, mom, try it. Ooh. Oh. Oh. How it tastes? Mm -mm. So good. <laughs> mm -mm. Let me, I'm going to try one. Try one. It's always good to suck the head. Let's me back home. Mmm. 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 Mm -hmm. This is so good. Mm -hmm. It's spicy, savory, buttery, <clears throat> everything. Yeah. So, so good. Guys, definitely try this. Very simple. Nice mm -hmm. dish. Very simple. Try it. You will love it. All right. So, we'll see you next time in the next video. All right. Give me a thumbs up, you guys. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up. Thumbs up. All right. Bye-bye, oh. guys. All right, guys. Mm.